Reddington Beach, a place to enjoy the pristine beaches of Tampa Bay without the massive crowds. Reddington Beach sits between two of the top three beaches in Pinellas County according to the 2019 TripAdvisor ratings. It is just to the south of number one Ryan Clearwater Beach and to the north of number three St. Pete Beach. For this video, we are including Reddington Shores and North Reddington Beach as well. Reddington Beach is located on a barrier island with the intercoastal waterway to the east and the Gulf of Mexico on the west. We start our tour at the Long Pier in Reddington Shores, which was damaged during Hurricane Irma in 2017. It is closed to the public. Currently, local residents are in a fight with public officials to keep this pier from being demolished. Reddington Beach is primarily a waterfront residential community with beachfront condos and single-family homes. In fact, the only major hotel you will find is the Doubletree Beach Resort in North Reddington Beach, popular for destination weddings. Therefore, it is not nearly as crowded as the other hotel-populated beaches of Pinellas County. Reddington Beach was once known as North Madeira Beach, established in 1945. It was named after Charles E. Reddington, a real estate developer and snowbird who frequently came down from the winters of his home in Indiana in the 1920s. He began buying up Pinellas County's mostly barren beachfront property from current day Madeira Beach to Indian Rocks Beach. He built the first home on Reddington Beach in 1935. By 1940, there were five homes. His vision was creating a West Coast version of Miami Beach. He built the Tides Hotel in 1940 in this effort. Although it was popular for a few years with a couple of celebrities visiting, in the ensuing years as times changed, the popular destination began losing both its appeal and profit. Charles Reddington's goal never came to pass, however he was able to put his mark on the barrier islands now known as Reddington Beach. Today Reddington Beach is known as a quaint beach community where you can enjoy the pristine beaches of the Gulf without the massive crowds of the bigger Pinellas County beaches. If you do like a little more activity and fun, Reddington Beach borders Madeira Beach to the south with Johns Pass Village, popular for shopping, dining, and nightlife. Johns Pass also offers a local fishing fleet, dolphin watching, boat rentals, shelling tours, parasailing, and jet skiing. I hope you have enjoyed our tour of Reddington Beach. Subscribe to our channel to see videos from all over the United States. This video as well as our other videos is available for licensing. See details in the description. Thank you for watching and enjoy your stay in Reddington Beach on Florida's Gulf Coast.